Hi guys doing today? This is Derek House from DHFTNS.com and today I'm going to show you guys my slow cooked sweet and spicy chicken lentils recipe. I'm hungry so let's get to it. The first thing you're going to do is take out your slow cooker. If you don't have a slow cooker, I highly recommend buying one. This one only costs around $25 to $30 shipped. I'll post a link to it below in the description. And then take out three and a half pounds or 56 ounces of chicken breast and trim the fat off of it. After you trim the fat off, cut your chicken breasts in half. Put your chicken into your slow cooker. Now add in one and a half tablespoons of olive oil. One and a half teaspoons of minced garlic or three cloves of regular garlic. One chopped sweet onion. However big or small you want to chop your onion is completely up to you. Six ounces or 170 grams of carrots. It's up to you if you want to chop them. I just buy the baby cut carrots so I don't have to. One teaspoon of basil. One and a half cups or 270 grams of lentils. If you've never had lentils, they're a great cheap source of fiber and protein. For every serving, there's 150 calories, seven grams of fiber and 11 grams of protein. 12 teaspoons or 60 grams of sriracha. 16 tablespoons or 288 grams of a barbecue sauce. You can use whatever barbecue sauce you want. And last, around two to three cups of water. You just wanna make sure that everything is submerged. Mix everything together. After everything is mixed together, put your slow cooker on low and let it cook for six hours. As far as the calories go in the whole recipe, there's 3,585, only 33 grams of fat, 318 grams of carbs, 50 grams of fiber and 504 grams of protein. After six hours on low heat, turn your slow cooker off. And there is your slow cooked sweet and spicy chicken lentils recipe. As you guys saw, the chicken is done. The smell of it is literally making me salivate. So now I'm just gonna try it. This recipe is so good that as you're eating it, you want to eat more right away because it smells so good. And the juice, you could pretty much drink the juice. That's how good it is. If that sounds disgusting, I'm sorry. It's a perfect blend of sweet and spicy. Not too sweet, not too spicy. It's just right. And the best part about this recipe, it's really cheap to make. All I do to portion it out is take out some Rubbermaid containers and my food scale and then just divide it up by weight evenly. If you don't have a food scale in your kitchen, they're a great investment. This is only around $25 shipped. I'll post a link to the exact one that I use in the description below. All right guys, I just want to thank you for watching. If you like this slow cooker recipe, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. It motivates me to keep making these. If you haven't already subscribed and you'd like to, you can click right there in the screen coming up. By subscribing, you'll get an email every week telling you I upload a new video. Comments or suggestions go down below. I do try and respond to everybody. Thank you guys again for watching. I got some chicken to finish. Stay healthy.